Hey guys, this is V and welcome to Designs by V. Today I am taking you around and even styling my outdoor slash kitchen slash whatever you want it to be. So I'm showing you how I showed you how it look at night. No, I'm showing you what it looks like in the daytime. So we're going to go ahead and style the buffet slash drinks area slash breakfast nook anything that you want it to be it's just a a fun space for me i'm showing you i hung some glass rack those glass um racks was found thrifting i think i paid a dollar and change for it and this is a plate rack that i have here remember the mini refrigerator and I am showing you the few things that I have out here. Um, some of the things that I want to put in place. See the opening in the bottom? I am going to eventually add a door to it. So I could store some things. Because as you guys know, I love storage. Storage is key to keeping the place neat and tidy. I'm showing you the two grills that I have up here. One is a flat top. The other one is a regular grill. And um, I love that it has storage in the bottom. It has a... This set is for bacon. I just never used it. And a burner. I love gas stove. I this buys electric stove and this fabric right here i want to use it in the top to bring a little cohesiveness with the black and white going i'm just loving it this year and i'm loving it in every pattern so i want to do like a balance all the way around and as you see the yellow is right there there's a few things that i want to put in place this is the rug that i'm going to use in this area this area rug and this is the cabinet that I also thrifted, got it from the ReStore, and I put height onto it, and it is storing my fryer. I am so happy about this storage. And at the Dollar Tree, I got a few mittens and a few kitchen towels that will house out there i have some snacks right there um to the back of this i have my rotisserie my grill cut works with a rotisserie then i also have some of the grill things that i will need for grilling like shish kebabs um stick egg rounds and spatulas and this is how everything is looking. A little bit of a mess. I also found this drawer here at the thrift store. I paid a dollar for it. I think previously that was inside of a refrigerator. And I want to use this to put snacks in. I was going to lift the refrigerator up in order to make a snack drawer under. But, you know, because this is clay, I say this will work perfectly. I picked up a few more glasses from the Dollar Tree because some of my stuff is still in storage with the insurance company. Remember when downstairs was flooded? So my stuff is still in storage, so I had to go buy some. Um, that door that I just shown you, that window that I just shown you is right off the kitchen. And that's where I want to put the valance. That's the valance that I want to use the color. And as you know the door i made the door also actually didn't make the door what i did was i purchased the door it was too short so i add to it i have a video coming with that so i put up some of the balance already and this is what it is looking like i cut it out myself and i wanted to do a little um dental detail on it and i'm just loving it so this is what it is looking like so far i think it is good so i'm debating if i want to take it all the way through and as you see i am finished with my balance and i have to do a little bit more right here but as you see it is going all the way around and i have to finish this part right here so now 
we're going to set up like a little bar situation today i'm going to use it as a i'm going to use this piece here as a bar it could be a buffet it could be like whatever you want it to be i also went ahead and put a door right here and i can't open the door all the way because of the wine refrigerator but it could open and i'm using i'm going to use this as storage plus you see i have that plug situation going on today i try to spray it so and the door opens and close so i'm going to go ahead and try to set this up and i'm going to take you step by step once i start putting some of the things up i have some glasses here already got them from the dollar tree and let me start with the glasses so I went ahead and put the glasses in place. Like I said, the, glass, the glasses came from the Dollar Tree. And we have the larger ones. We have the champagne. And then the white wine, red wine. So I have this plate right here that I got um, thrifting a while back. So let me put some plates in here, some snack plates. The You know this year I am doing... Um, black and white with yellow that's why I did the black splash and I'm just loving the black furniture today like I said we're going to do a mock bar and um, setting up a bar area hole I will not fully set it up but just for styling purposes want to show you guys what I did so this is what we have so far I have this thrifted find right here this urn and then I have one of the topiaries in there. This clock was a thrifted find. And that was $3. I haven't taken the price off of it yet. And have some napkins here. And a little bit of greenery. Also, I have this vase here that I thrifted. And as you see, the wine o'clock is right here. Because anytime is a good time for a drink. So... I will leave this to music and you will enjoy the rest of it, me putting this together.
And guys, I know this process was a long one because I wanted to build a piece that it will be presentable. And I am so happy on how it came out. And now to style it, oh, it's like I gave birth. I would like to thank everyone that left comment and let me know how good I was doing. Like I said, it was a long process, but if you like what I'm doing here, please like, subscribe, share. Hit the notification that when I upload videos, you will be one of the first to be notified. Guys, I always also have an Instagram. You could come over there and visit. It's Designs by V with three E's. That's V-E-E. -E. Again, please like, subscribe, share. Hit the notification because I have a lot more coming for you.